Uh, first of all, uh, Republican Leader Kevin McCarthy said last night that it is clear we are going to take the House back. Do you think he's probably right about that? Well, based on what we know as, as of today, we've, uh, we've lost very few seats for certain. Uh, we still have a possibility of, uh, of keeping the House, but it's going to be close. And, for example, in, uh, in, in Nevada, we won all three of those seats, contested seats. I went out for each and I spoke with each, for each of those folks, but um, we won them all. I didn't know that last night. So it, it, it's a moving target right now, but it's going to be very close. Can you describe your relationship with Mr. McCarthy? How often do you speak to him? What do you think of him? I think he's a Republican leader, and uh, I haven't had much of occasion to talk to him. But I will be talking to him, I think. Uh, I think I'm talking to him later today. When it comes to your legislative agenda, when you were vice president, your legislative agenda basically ran into a brick wall two years in when Republicans took control of the House, and that lasted for the rest of the Obama presidency. Is there any way for you to prevent that same fate from happening this time around? Yes. If Republicans take control of the House? Yes, uh, because it's going to be much closer if they take control. They can't, look, the predictions were, and again, I'm not being critical of anybody who made the predictions. I got it, okay? This is supposed to be a red wave. You guys, you were talking about us losing 30 to 50 seats, and this was going to. No, we're, that's not going to happen. And so there's always enough people. In the, on the other team, whether it's Democrat or Republican, that the opposite party can make an appeal to and maybe pick them off to get the help. And, uh, and so it remains to be seen. But look, I, I, I doubt whether or not, uh, for example, all the talk, uh, I'd ask the rhetorical, I don't expect you to answer, but the rhetorical question, um, do you think that, uh, um, you know, uh, Senator Johnson is going to move to cut Medicare and Social Security? And if he does, how many Republicans are going to vote for it? So it depends.